How's our chickens doing, Hudson? Good. They look pretty good? Yes. Have you been feeding them? Yes. Okay, good. Because look, they're laying eggs. Well, they're not laying eggs because the eggs will be right here. So that's a little hint of what's to come, hopefully. So we're still on day two. This is the broke farmer. As you see up in the top right, we only have a little over $2,000. We started with zero. This is Hudson's first day at this farm. If it's your first day, go back a few videos, check out our start to this farm. Um, this is only our third video, so you can catch up really easy. Quick rundown, we started with zero dollars. We've made our way to 2,000. Uh, we have bought a few things for hay. That seems to be the easiest way, but we've also messed up along the way and we planted some corn. We also have some pigs here. Could you tell me the pig's name? We don't have the names. That's actually something we'll get a hold of though, okay? Okay. Here later on, we'll name the pigs. And what about the chickens? There's kind of a lot of chickens. I don't know if we have, I don't yeah. even know if I know that many names. <laughs> yeah. So we planted some corn, but we're not too sure we're going to have enough money for a harvester yet. We made a field here. We cut it. Today, we're actually going to start bailing this. So we're going to have our day two, which is today. And we're also going to sleep probably in our tractor because we don't have a house yet. So you'll get to see the next day also. So if you give this video a thumbs so up just like that, hopefully something good will pop up in the used tractor department because I'm in the market for anything. Yeah. Anything we need, I wanna buy it. So if you give this video a thumbs up, maybe that'll give us just enough luck to get something we need. And if you don't give it a thumbs up, you'll have, if you open your front door, you'll have hay everywhere. <laughs> there you go. If you don't give this video a thumbs up, when you open your front door, there'll be hay everywhere. That might be a good <laughs> thing though if you're a farmer. So here's what we're gonna do today. I wanna tether this field, I wanna rake this field, and I wanna start belling, and I wanna go to bed, see how much, our corn has grown. See if our animals give us, I don't know, maybe, maybe more pigs or eggs or something like that because it'll be June when we wake up. It goes by months every time we sleep. Um, so we have $2,000. We need to buy a rake though. We don't have a rake at all. So how much do we need? Oh, that's the wrong thing. Windrows. So the cheapest one is 5,000, but I would prefer okay. this one, which is 5,900. Luckily for us, I'm gonna show you something. We cut some logs, didn't we? Yes. So we cut some logs earlier today. Like I said, we're not gonna do any of the selling, any of the buying without y'all. So you ready to sell this? Yes. Okay, let's sell this. Hopefully we get 5,900. That is what I am hoping for. So please. I hope we get 9,900. High five. We got enough. Okay, let's buy us a, actually tell you what. Should we just buy a, uh, go buy, let's buy it right now. We'll buy the rake. I'll show you which one we're gonna buy. Where's it at? Um, this one right here. We're gonna buy this one, load it up and take it back to our farm, okay? Okay. All right, let's do it. So we're on the way back from purchasing this rake, which I'm excited about because now we have everything needed to do hay. And you know about hay, don't you? Yes. He likes to play with the hay. He farms hay with me on our real farm. Uh, it's a lot of fun, so I'm excited. We've already got it cut. We've got to tether it, rake it, and then bail it, right? Right. And then are you going to load it all up? Yes. Okay, so we've made the purchase of the rake. We have $2,000 here, so we need a harvester. Let's check out the used one. It should be the same as yesterday. It is because we have not changed the day yet. The cheapest harvester we can get, oh my gosh, $75,000, Hudson. And we yeah, only have 2,000. Go on, tractor. As long as it's running. I also want to upgrade our tractor. I think I said that last time, yeah. but this tractor is, uh, what is it? Straight dog doo-doo. That's right, it is straight dog doo-doo. It has hardly any power. It struggles to do pretty much everything. So I want to upgrade it. But like I said, we're out here, no cheats at all, trying to make it, trying to start with this little broken down farm and turn it in to something great. So that's what we're trying to do. I want to get like a 40, 20 or something like that. I just, we're trying our best. We'll see if we get there. So here's what we're going to do. Let's drop this trailer off for now. We don't need it yet. We got to hook up the tether, start tethering this field, and then we got to rake it. Okay. Okay. Animals, we don't have horses and dog. We, we plan on getting a lot of animals. We just don't have the money yet. And I had to wait a little bit because I know you like to spend money. So I had to wait until I had a little money saved up to bring you because we everybody knows that Hudson just likes to buy. But I'll have you whenever we save up enough money, you will be the first person to buy a new tractor for us, okay? Okay. Because this is the only tractor we have. And look at our guy. He has a mustache. <laughs> Hudson does not like mustaches, but our guy, he has a mustache, doesn't he? Yeah. Okay, let's, uh, let's, let's tether a little bit more and then I want to go ahead and uh, start raking and get to bailing a little bit, okay? Because I'm excited to see what tomorrow has in store for us. Hopefully it has something good for us. So we'll do probably half this field today, half the field tomorrow. I also don't know how much hay bales sell for um, on here. I'm kind of hoping they sell for quite a bit, but they also might not. Okay, that's that's good enough now. We're going to park the tether right here. 
I want to rake a little bit and bell a little bit before it gets dark. I know a great name for the one pig. What is it? Catilda. Catilda? <laughs> what kind of name is that? Catilda. <laughs> All right, I guess. I've I'm, never seen a, a single wheel rake like this. I'm, I saw a one. We, th we throw it in the corn. That's probably not a probably not ideal. But I well. know what it does. Oh, you know what it does? It just swipes like around and makes stuff. Yeah, so it rakes the hay into a row, right? Yeah. Yeah, I just never seen one wheel like this. I didn't know what side it was going to throw it to. So now we know it throws it to the left, so that's good. I don't know anything about the beller we have either. I don't even know if it works, honestly. It came with the abandoned farm. So it's probably in pretty rough shape, but hopefully it's in good enough shape to at least bell a little bit. Biggest task is the trees because we like have a million trees over there. That is true. We have a ton of trees and they make a decent amount of money. We've bought in almost everything from trees. It's like the only way to start. So with just a chainsaw and a trailer, you can start and uh, end up where about we are, which we're not far, but we've made we've made some progress. Another dog doo doo. I'm saying. It said dog doo doo forever. Dog doo doo forever? <laughs> okay. Because um, we're going to call this tractor dog doo doo. Dog doo doo. Okay, let's see. Let's go ahead and drop the rake right there. I want to get a little bit of this build before it gets dark. So let's see how this baler does. That is not the baler. There it is right there. I don't think... Can I... I don't think I can hook, the, hook this up to our trailer. I don't think that works. Why do you need the trailer? So it puts all the square bills onto the trailer automatically, but I don't think it has an attachment. It doesn't have a hook. Yeah, I don't see one either, so we'll I know have to do we're it by gonna ourselves. name this. All right, let's unfold this thing. You ready to go? Okay. Our first time belling hay. Does it work? With haul. It does work. Perfect. Okay, hopefully we could just keep driving. We don't have to stop or anything. Please tell me. I think we're skipping. No, no, no. We're doing good. We're doing good. It's we're just harvesting it all right now. Okay, so it actually goes at a decent speed. We're making a few square bills. Not much, though. Okay, that's kind of disappointing. We're not making too much. We're making some. It's like All right, so we pooped one out so far. <laughs> but we, we need more than that, though. Okay, so we're, we're getting somewhere now. And once we do this whole field, there will be a lot of square bills on the ground. But I at least want to get this belt up for now. Go to sleep. I know I keep saying it, but tomorrow we really need to get lucky tomorrow. Maybe eggs. I don't know. Something. We need something good. And we got to see who wants to buy hay from us, too. Okay. We can't just like go to random people. We gotta find someone who's gonna pay us a good price for hay. I really wish we had a truck though, because like a truck yes. will go so much faster in town. Where this is just kind of slow motion. Because when we load this thing up on a trailer, this tractor is just so slow. So I'm confused why it's like just staying there. Okay, so here's what happens. I'll show you. So these things right here, that's what sucks the hay up, and then it compresses it into a square ball like this. So then as it pushes the hay out, then this starts coming out more. Oh, what happens if we grab it? I don't know. I don't think we can. No, we can't. Oh. It's stuck in here. So once it, we get more hay to push it through, then it'll push this bell out. Oh. So that's why. So watch. Once we start sucking up more hay, and it starts making another bell. See? Oh, yeah. And then it starts coming out. So it's just a continuous line of hay coming out. We made, um, what do you think, about 20 hay bells so far? Okay, so let's pause there. Um, we need to find a good place to go to bed tonight. Where do you think? On, on one of these hay bales? Or cabin? Should we make a hay, should we make a hay bed? What about ca our cabin? Well, there's not really much in there. We can make a little hay bed. What do you think? We could just sleep on this tonight. <laughs> I think that's our only option, honestly. What do you think about right here? Does that look comfy? No. You don't think so? No, we're gonna uh, wake up like hairy the night. Well, yeah, but look over here. Look how tall the grass is in here. There's like nowhere to sleep in here. Look at this. What about on the cutter? The cutter. On the hay cutter right there? Let's, let's sleep on the no, hay. Let's just sleep on that. the hay. This? You mean just sleep on this? Yeah. That is so uncomfortable. We have hay bells over here. Let's sleep on the hay. We'll get a little messy, but that's all right. Come on. Let's go to bed. Oh, we need to make like a little house so nothing attacks us. Nothing's going to attack us. We'll be fine. All right. Let's go to bed. Let's wake up and see what tomorrow has. All right. We'll wake up at nine. We're going to get a good sleep tonight. How was your sleep last night? Bad. Yeah, my back hurts. Um, so as you see, like I said, it goes by the month. So now we're in June. So the hay is starting to grow a little bit, but we can still harvest this. So we'll, we'll end up tethering this and raking this all up. Okay, let's see how our animals are. Let's go check on the animals. And the corn. Look how much the corn has grown. It's grown a lot. Um, If we um, get everything done, we can buy like a, 
um, a harvest. Oh, look! So we have the same amount of pigs. Look, look! Oh, that one's sleeping. Hey, wake up! It's it's already it's already nine a.m., dude. Look at and, this. Oh, we got some eggs. Oh, oh perfect. Eggs. So now we're starting to produce some eggs, so we can sell those. We'll wait till we get some more. Um, that's not enough for us to make a trip to sell, but looks like we're starting to make some eggs. Yeah. Which is good. That's another uh source of revenue. So I that's think good. that's like twenty eggs. Oh, Hudson, we gotta check the used equipment. Are you ready? Yes. This could be huge. Let's see what we got. Come on, please something good. Please something good. Oh no. So there's like a planter cedar, which we don't need. We already kind of have one. A Massey Ferguson tractor, 44% off, which is pretty big, but it's an expensive tractor. So it's $80,000. There's no way we can afford that. Not even close. This is like sugar beets. So we got lucky yesterday. Today is just a terrible day. Okay. So the animal dealer is buying for $92. Where is the animal dealer at? Let's see. Where is the animal dealer? Is it you? So the animal dealer is there all the way back at the port. So that is a long trip. So I, we are here, Hudson. It is literally the other side of the map. What? Yeah, so we're not going to make that trip until we have all of this build. And we might even make another cutting bell before we even make the trip and just load up our trailer. Because that's a long trip for us. What about eggs? Who buys eggs? Eggs. The supermarket. Oh, eggs are expensive. We might need to buy more chickens. Think we should buy more chickens? That's um, a lot of money for eggs. Uh, um, and where's the supermarket at? It's probably in town, I would assume. There it is, right there. Okay, so it is in town. That's not too far. Um, I think we buy more. I think we buy more chickens. What about you? No, no. Um, that is like so much money we can buy. Well, we it is, but it's not. It's still not enough to buy a harvester. It's not enough, but we can probably buy a house. <laughs> True. We could buy a house. We probably could buy a tent. We do need somewhere to sleep. That was a rough night last night. Let's see. I think we buy more chickens. What about you? Uh, let's, let's buy, let's buy, um, so we can hold 30. So it doesn't hold too much, actually. Let's buy five roosters. Because they Perfect. can wake us up. Let's buy five of the older chickens. And then we get one of the younger ones. All right, so now our chicken coop is maxed out to the max. I want to see the hens. See them in there? Yeah. The roosters. Rooster. Okay, so now it's maxed out. So hopefully tomorrow when we wake up, we'll have more eggs than we do now. The pigs, not doing so hot. They still need water, as you see. So we're struggling on that department. But we will get them water soon, what I promise. What do pigs give us? They just make more pigs. And oh. then we can sell the pigs. So we're going to finish bailing this field. We got to tether it. We got to rake it. We're going to bail it. And then we'll probably load all this up on our trailer. Let us know what is next for this farm. What do you guys want? How do we make more money? Because we're kind of struggling a little bit. We're getting by, but we're struggling, aren't we? Yeah. Let us know your thoughts. I know y'all said a greenhouse. We're still going to look into that. But let me know your thoughts. Do we need to get a greenhouse? Uh, he doesn't know what a greenhouse is, do you? Yeah, there's no way. So if you guys enjoyed the video, green, give uh, a thumbs up. I know a uh, uh, house we can get. Blue house. Blue house. Okay, he wants a blue house. If you guys enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs no. up. Let us know your thoughts. Not. If you're enjoying the series, let us know. We would appreciate it. Until next time, make sure you thumbs Not up, like, subscribe. We'll show our videos. Bye. Bye.